Uh, welcome. Today's uh, Monday, April 22nd. Uh, this is the Board of Health meeting. We'll uh, call the meeting to order. And uh, I'd like to uh, review the agenda. Is there anything we need to add or delete? Um, no, I think we are, um, we have everything here. Uh, actually, the, um, the inspections will probably hold till next time. Perfect. Okay, so we'll hold on the inspections. Perfect. Um, next, we have approval of the minutes dated uh, we'll, we'll, um, February 5th, February 25th, and March 25th. Uh -huh. um, I've read them in there. Um, and we'll deal with, uh, I do have a change on one of them, the uh, March 25th one, but we'll deal with uh, February 5th. Mm -hmm. um, so I get just to entertain a motion to approve the minutes. And that one, uh, just to is February 18 and 19. Okay. Right. Mm -hmm. So, entertain a motion to? I'll make a motion to approve the minutes for February 5th, 2018. And I'll second that motion and all those in favor? Aye. Aye. Thank you. Next one is February 25th of 2019. And a motion to approve these minutes. Okay. I'll make a motion to approve the February 25th, 2019 minutes. And I was not at this meeting. Yeah. So I don't know if we may have to yeah. wait until Steve gets here. Uh, actually, yeah, why don't we, um, hold why don't we hold these till Steve comes. Paul, will you just make a note? And the last one is uh, March 25th, 2019. Mm -hmm. And uh, I did have a few changes on here under the approval of the previous minutes. There was a um, third, Steve Norberg, and third, Eric Hardison. That's going to be stricken. Mm -hmm. From there, and it's just going to read uh, vote in favor um, three to zero. So, with mm -hmm. those changes, I would uh, vote to uh, entertain a motion mm -hmm. to approve these minutes. Mm -hmm. I make a motion to approve the minutes of uh, March 25th with the changes of uh, February, so 2019. 2019. Thank you for the changes proposed. I'll second that motion. All those in favor? Aye. Aye. Right. Um, next up, we have a hearing on the uh, Board of Health uh, fee schedule. The proposed changes, I've been in a motion to open the hearing. I'd like to make a motion to open the hearing for the changes, excuse me, for the proposed changes for the Board of Health fee schedule. I'll second that meeting and all those in favor of opening the meeting. Aye. The hearing is now open. Yeah. Good. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Please. Okay. Um, so thank you very much. We, um, we've had a, um, a uh, good amount of time that we've been working on the fee schedule. We're uh, pretty excited to um, to uh, bring you kind of the final version. Um, and I think I had mentioned it's been um, quite some time, uh, about six years or so, almost six years, since we um, did the last fee change. Uh, so um, we have the proposed fees here. Um, there's just some minor um, minor changes. The there's been a, a co-change at the state for um, for uh, potentially hazardous foods. They're now called uh, time temperature control for safety. So we're going to add that wording uh, down at the bottom. Um, that wording, and then we're also um, looking to add a septic abandonment um, uh, fee for fifty dollars. Uh, we do those um, abandonments now um, and take some coordination and just some paperwork. So mm -hmm. um, we'd like okay. to add that. Excellent. Sure. Um, I don't, there's no one here for public comment or, or for the hearing at all. I know you guys have worked very hard and tirelessly on that one. Thank mm -hmm. you for your uh, your effort with this. Hopefully this will streamline it and um, make the office a little bit better. And um, certainly was um, had to have been painstaking. So I think <laughs> yeah. uh, certainly acknowledge the, uh, those that worked 
um, so so hard on this and everything too. So I think that's um, that, that's there's great work. So um, Thank you. Thank if uh, there's no other question, any questions? No, no, I have no questions either. I, I, I'd like the fee schedule okay. and certainly. Yeah, uh, thank you. Uh, I'd entertain a motion to approve the okay. fee schedule with those changes. Okay. I'd like to uh, make a motion to approve the fee schedule, um, including the changes for um, the proposed by Ms. Coyle. Right. I'll second that motion. All those in favor? Aye. Aye. And uh, mm -hmm. so we need to close this hearing now. Uh, entertain a motion to close the hearing. Close the hearing. Make a motion to close the hearing. And I second that. All those in favor? Aye. Aye. Hearing is now closed. The schedule is approved. Excellent. The next hearing is uh, scheduled for 615. There is a local upgrade approval request for 320 Leicester Street. Make a motion to um, open this hearing. Do we have to wait to um, do that? I think we just have two, just a few minutes. Two okay. Minutes. You want to do it until? <laughs> yeah, okay. we can just wait okay. just, sure. a, just a few minutes. I can uh, probably mm -hmm. update you on the others. Okay. Other items, if that's okay. Sure, we'll go ahead and skip down the director's items. Okay. Um, so we have um, animal control. We have a rabies clinic mm -hmm. um, this Saturday. Uh, so that's a rabies and a microchipping clinic. We're going to have it right here at the town hall. Um, and the animal control officer has been sending out um, uh, blast emails, uh, social media posts. Um, we'll have the uh, message board as well. That uh, rabies and microchipping clinic is actually open to the public, not just Auburn. And we, we've had uh, it grow over the past, um, I think this is our fourth year doing it. Um, so we're pretty excited about that. Um, we've kind of seen a lot of people come into compliance with being able to get a, um, uh, a reduced rate rabies and microchipping clinic. Um, and then dog licensing reminder, I uh, just wanted to um, let you know that dog licenses are due now and um, fees, will, uh, fees will incur um, starting in May. So animal control just wanted to get that information out. Um, solid waste, um, we have a spring yard waste schedule. Um, so it's a, uh, we're trying something a little bit different this year. Um, in the past, we've done four pickups on Saturdays, four consecutive Saturdays. This year, we are going to try um, doing the four consecutive pickups, but they are actually going to be um, on your pickup day. So if you have a Monday um, trash pickup um, schedule, then your leaves are going to get picked up on Monday, four consecutive weeks. We're hoping that it's going to um, uh, help keep people um, give people better service mm -hmm. and um, hopefully uh, having the truck go right behind the other truck essentially so the trash will get picked up and then at some point during that day um, the yard waste will be picked up as well um, so that schedule has been posted um, that's on the town website that's on uh, cable access we'll also have the board um, identifying that the, um, the big thing on that, too, is um, letting people know not to use their toter for yard waste. So a lot of people think they can use the toter and load it up with yard waste. You can't do it. So you have to use the uh, biodegradable um, paper yard waste bags or just open containers. So if you have like an open container from Sears, you can use that. You just can't use your, your toter. Okay. All right. And then not more than 50 pounds. <clears throat> All right, so um, that, and we also have a town-wide cleanup um, event. The, um, this is every other year. The town and the Auburn Chamber works together to do a town-wide cleanup. Uh, it's going to be a great event. It's May 4th um, from 8 to uh, 12, and we're going to have headquarters at um, the fire station on Auburn Street. We have um, a lot of uh, really nice free services. We have a uh, free community um, shredding uh, that they're going to have a truck uh, parked down at Bank, Hope T Bank Hometown at 569 South Bridge Street. People can bring up to three boxes of um, documents. They'll shred them confidentially. Um, Central Mass Mosquito Control is going to have a truck uh, behind the fire station. People can bring um, tires. Uh, that's a free service. Um, tires have to have the rims removed. And then we're also going to be taking uh, batteries, so um, old um, car batteries or um, the um, uh, rechargeable batteries, batteries that you have in equipment, um, we'll be taking those batteries for free. And then we'll have a metal um, drop-off. Uh, so um, if you have like an old um, lawnmower or snowblower, 
um, things like that, washer, dryers. Air conditioners. Um, air conditioners, yep. Yeah, okay. Yep. So anything that has gasoline that's run by gasoline, it has to be um, empty. So you'd have to run run the gas out. But okay. um, the metal items are, um, are going to be for free. Um, so you just have to refer to the list that we have. Um, and uh, it's a great event. Um, we ask for volunteers. They're going to be um, scattered all around the town. We're going to have PPW um, and uh, businesses um, keeping uh, people hydrated with snacks. And then there's also a free lunch in it at the Outback um, when we cut, when we commence. So awesome. it's um, it's fabulous. Great. And I think we're probably at yeah, that's time. it with all the directors, okay. items, I believe. And um, we're now uh, right at 6:15. I have. Well, uh, I would entertain a motion to opening the uh, approval request for 230 Lester Street. So moved. So moved. Is there a second? second. All those in favor? Aye. 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 We will open this meeting. Okay. Um, so this um, is 230 Lester Street. You may recall um, this plan actually came before you. Um, uh, within the past, um, within the past couple of months, um, we had uh, the board review it. it. As you can see, it's a pretty tight lot. It's a pretty large system, and this um, this was the house that we have an existing well um, here, and this is the one that also had public water available. The board had um, approved the LUAs um, from the last time for the bedroom count, and. Um, the uh, local upgrade approval for distance from the well to the septic. Um, since that time, I can tell you that um, some uh, great update is the um, owner of the property has decided to connect uh, to public water, and so they're going to abandon the well. So that's um, uh, a great um, addition to the plan. And then um, with the uh, redesign and the re revision, um, the engineer has an offset to groundwater um, that's less than um, four feet. So um, three foot offset to groundwater. So we just wanted to um, bring it back to the board. Um, it is something that is allowable. And um, as you can see, um, it's it's pretty tight, um, some mm. of the constraints of it. They um, have try to uh, maximize the area for the system. So it would be um, a local upgrade approval request that is in allowance with um, Title V. So it would just be the, the final groundwater offset for three foot. Okay. Well, any questions? Concerns? Seeing no other concerns or discussion points, no, I entertain a motion to approval. So I'll make a motion to approve the requested uh, for offset to three feet. I'll second motion to approve the offset to three feet. All those in favor? Aye. 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 Thank you very much. And, uh, entertain a motion to close the hearing. I'll make a motion to close second. the hearing. Second, and all those in favor? Aye. 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 Okay, we have a hearing at 6.20, another um, time, right at 6.20. Uh, okay, we we'll give it one more minute. Okay. Um, I think we were all done up on the, um, the director's items. Yes, and I do have, um, I have the uh, disease report. Maybe her mm -hmm. We can take a peek at that now. Sure. And as you may recall from the last meeting, um, we were waiting for the report, so there's actually two in there. Excellent, okay. Thank you. What's that? That's out like 20. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 <clears throat> Tis the season. Oh, yeah. Don't go on strong. Yeah, so. What date is that? This is um, 228, and this okay. is 328. So yeah, so it actually went up. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Which I'm not surprised. There's nothing really outside of the usual. Yeah. 
Oh, thank you. I now have uh, 620. I'd entertain a motion to open the hearing for uh, 411 Leicester Street. Can make that open? And is there a second? Second motion. All those in favor of opening the hearing? Aye. 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 The Aye. hearing is now open. Okay. So this is a um, uh, septic plan that we received at 411 Leicester Street. Um, this property um, has been a vacant property for some time. Um, it has um, a existing failed system. However, there hasn't been anybody in the house for uh, many years. Um, this uh, property has a um, uh, has a, a new owner from when it uh, failed uh, previously, and a um, plan has been prepared. The um, this. This is Leicester Street, and um, there's wetlands um, uh, on this property, so um, or adjacent to this property. There has been um, a review by Conservation Commission. Um, they actually uh, reviewed it extensively with the property owner, and this has actually been a uh, um, redesigned um, to conservation um, requirements as well. Um, the LUAs that are being um, required is um, local upgrade approval um, for the system um, to less than 50 feet to the resource area, which is the wetland area. Um, there's also a uh, local upgrade approval for an alternative to perk testing. Um, SIP analysis was taken, um, which is also allowed on a system repair and then um, the um, system design plus one. Um, these are all um, these are all requests that have been reviewed by um, the board previously, and they are allowable for system repair. Um, the uh, property is also served by a um, existing well, and we do have um, uh, this. In the area, um, the properties around here are also served by uh, private well and, and septic. So you can see uh, neighboring property, um, this property, and then there's also a well over here. Um, so they had to, had to find the best location for the system, um, and they've had to work around the well distances and also the resource areas. So it has been located. Um, located in an area that meets requirements with these alleyways. Any discussion, any questions, concerns? So the proposal meets all conservation commission requirements and it does. conditions. Yes. Okay. Yep. So they so conservation actually issued an order of conditions. And this plan meets all those conditions. Mm -hmm. Thank you. <coughs> Anything else? Yes. So the the various requests are um, just the offset to the variance requests are uh, local upgrade approval um, for the SAS to be less than 50 feet to the resource mm -hmm. area, um, the LUA for um, alternative to perk testing or SIV analysis, and the um, uh, design plus one requirement through the board of health. So we're dropping the plus one. That's what they're requesting. Yes. We'll move to uh, accept and approve the requested variance with a 50, 50 foot offset, the set analysis, and the uh, the bedroom flow. We can technically word that. <laughs> Is there a second? I second the motion second. to approve. All those in favor? Aye. 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 Thank you very much. Thank you. Um, it's a motion to close the hearing for 411 Lester Street. So moved. So second. There's a second. All those in favor? Aye. Aye. Okay. Um, moving on, directors' items. I think we had hit all of those. Um, I think we did. And we did the community, and we're going to hold on the inspection request. Um, so with that, I think. We needed to accept. Oh, we need, yeah, we need to go back and do yeah. these bits. Yeah, um, so, what Steve needs to bring up to speed. Um, 
um, February 25th, uh, there was a meeting that I was not at, so I okay. can't uh, so participate I'll in that. Move so. to approve. Okay, so there is a. Uh, February 5th, 2018. Oh, no, I'm sorry, no. no. February 25th, 2019. Yeah. Yep, that's what you said. That's what you said, February 25th, 2019? February 25th, 25th. yes, yeah, sorry. These are the ones here. This is the one that I missed. Okay, did I have that in my folder? Yeah, the, um, the ones are on the desk. I mean, they're on the table. Okay. Well, all right. So yeah, this is February 5th, 2018. That was, that was uh, right. Yeah. Okay. And is this in that package or is this not? No, those came oh, today. Okay. Yeah. No, the 2019 were in the packet. Oh, 2000. Yeah, right. The, the ones for 2018 were added. Were added yeah. today, but they were on the agenda. The um, this was uh, I think a little bit longer. Maybe. <coughs> the board meeting minutes of February 25, 2019. Is there a second? I second the motion to accept February 25, 2019 board minutes. Okay. All those in favor? Aye. And there is one item that you're stating. It's not present. Mm -hmm. Paula, do you have that? The what? Eric abstained. I, I abstained. Because he wasn't at that meeting. Mm -hmm. Thank right. you so much. So we have, um, I think that's it. Yeah, so we got, we're getting caught up on minutes. Paul yep. is doing a great job hanging those out. And um, we will have, um, we'll send out a uh, notice for the next day. Um, so yep. we'll shoot for May. We're coming into um, kind of the holidays <laughs> for summertime. Yeah. yeah. So. Excellent. Did you guys approve uh, March 25 minutes? Uh, yes. Yeah. The change. All right. Uh, I just noticed, uh, and I don't know if you may have discussed that uh, as chair. Did, did you catch this? Uh, yes. The, um, yeah. Is that the one you no, pointed out last time? Second and third. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. 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 All right, I'd like to take a motion to uh, adjourn. I'll make a motion to adjourn. All right, we'll second. And all those in favor? Aye. Awesome. Thank you. Thank you.